So perfect blue skies, almost no wind, beautiful sunshine. These are indeed conditions for the beautiful game. The backdrop here, picturesque, idyllic. No doubt one of the best days of the footballing calendar and it has added to a really jovial, happy mood in the stands, helping to raise the level of sound by more than a few decibels. Shirt sleeve order, very much the dress code. Old Trafford rising to the occasion as only Old Trafford can. Some terrific scenes at the Stratford end. Jim, which player is best equipped for this game? Yeah, Paul Pogba. He could be a real game changer for this team, Peter. He's got the strength to hold off defenders and the technical ability to pick out a killer pass. He can also shoot with great power and accuracy. He's a real midfield dynamo, actually, capable of, of winning a tackle in his own half and then charging downfield to make something happen at the other end. Box to box. Yes, getting the best out of him will count for so much. So it's away we go then. Smalling goes looking. Maguire tries to clear. Ndidi. Chaudhry. Madison. Gets wrestled off the ball. Yeah, he's pulled him up for that challenge. Away from immediate danger. Shaw. Shaw drives it forward. And the Herrera. Lukaku. Lukaku! Very speculative with little threat, if any, for the keeper. Leicester seem happy to let their strikers roam out wide. I wouldn't want that. No? Yeah, well, my worry is that their, their main threat is being shifted out of contention. Forward it goes. And the Herrera. Herrera. Pogba. Never side yet able to force a breakthrough here. Smalling hoists it forward. Well, the ball's come loose and the chase is on. It's Lukaku! Oh, fine stop from the keeper. Well, that was high class goalkeeping there to back up his, his high class wage. Maguire plays it out to the wing. Chilwell. Chilwell going full steam ahead down the left flank. And back out it comes. Can't get the better of his opposite number. Chowdhury has got himself a free kick. Defending of the desperate variety. Ndidi. All Brighton. And he's there to hoof it away. More than happy to take the muscular approach. There is the half-time whistle. 
So the other team has broken through, but certainly not for the want of trying. It's been an interesting game up to now, but still goals. A intriguing half, lacking only in goals. The score, nil nil. Here we go again then. Manchester United can feel really happy with themselves. The scoreline doesn't back it up, but they've played with urgency and purpose and can't afford to lose patience in this second half. They've got to persevere. Chaudhry. Tielemans. Didi. Ricardo Pereira. Pogba gets it back. We're still waiting for a goal to report here. Rashford. Lindelof plays it forward. It's a long pass, but not the most accurate. Tielemans. And it's all bright. And it's played forward. Lukaku. Lingard. Tielemans. Great strength, too strong for his opponent. And it's Matic. Shaw delivers. Towering! It's a goal! Well, what a signal that is for the opposition. There really isn't much time to get a goal back now. Talking about drama. Thinking about that, I think they've perfected that on the training ground because it took them seconds to get the ball from back to front. They really can look forward to numbers too. It was all very well drilled. So here comes the substitution. Deadlock broken, it's 1-0. I think the danger for them now is fatigue. I think when the body tires, the mind soon follows. So concentration is key from here. And it's Chilwell. Chowdhury. Keep calm and carry on. That's the job in a nutshell now. Matic tries to get it forward quickly. Ashley Young. Good challenge. He just stood firm. Yeah, it's safe to say that they just need to manage this to secure the win now. That will be the final act. Manchester United win it by the only goal. Result, no question, the most important thing, however it came. Final score, 1-0. Let's just summarise what we've seen today.